Here's how two major newspapers have reviewed your performance last night. The Washington Post titled their article, How to Disappear Completely by Lincoln Chafee. The Boston Globe called it Lincoln Chafee's No Good, Very Bad Night. Uh, that, here's, here's what worries me, uh, Governor, that you know, because of your distinguished career, you're going to wind up looking silly if you keep going on like this. At what point will you decide, you know what, there are other things for me to do instead of a futile effort to try to get the Democratic presidential nomination? Well, there was certainly a lesson last night to uh, appear there and only get nine minutes out of two hours. And it reaffirmed what I thought when I got into the race and that the establishment just does not want to hear an anti-war voice. And that motivates me even more uh, to continue this campaign. And yes, I've had a distinguished career. I've served at all levels of government. I've been a United States senator and a governor. Uh, but these issues are so important and I want to continue to raise them. And well, I will. Bernie, Bernie Sanders uh, is anti-war. He makes that case that he's generating a lot of support. He's raising millions and millions of dollars. He's doing remarkably well. Uh, you're not, though, right? Uh, no, I disagree. I've been to many events with uh, Senator Sanders, and he rarely talks about international issues. And uh, th that's my issue that I'm talking about. Senator Sanders does not talk about what's happening in the Middle East and across North Africa at the times I've heard him. He, he does mention it, but very, very fleetingly. So at what point will you drop out? I'm in it as far as I can uh, continue to raise these issues. Uh, they, they're important, and I, I feel strongly about that.